guys, it's your boy K5 the Cam Bob, bringing you another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 gameplay. First of all, if you notice my intro, I I'm proud to say that I'm partnered with the Awesome TV Network. So just to get that out of the way, why you saw the extra intro at the beginning. Now to get into the topic of today. Now I know most of you people have heard by now that the official release date for the reveal of the multiplayer aspect of Call of Duty uh, Ghost is on August 14th and that's great news for everyone because now we get to see what they ha what they're gonna give out for us so I wanted to you know put out my wish list for what I want to see extra in Black Ops 2 I mean we know they're gonna have the customization and the tra traps and even though I really wish they didn't have the traps, but that that's a different story. Uh, f so what I want to see in Black Ops 2, uh, first of all, I know everyone says it, but I want to see dedicated servers. It's it. Uh, you have way too much money not to have dedicated servers by now. From all the Call of Duty titles you have had, Activision. I mean, come on, seriously. You can't even oh afford to spend a little bit of money on dedicated servers I mean Battlefield 3 has dedicated servers hence why there's no lag problems there I can't you can't give the Call of Duty players dedicated servers that's what really frustrates a lot of people because usually you're a few seconds behind somebody if the lag works against you or and when the lag doesn't work against you it works in your favor then it feels like an entirely different game you're getting kills that you're supposed to be getting and everything so that's w one thing off my wish list another thing is basically balanced gunplay basically I want the guns I don't want to be forced to pick one gun over a another I want versatility cuz in Black Ops 2 the guns you can clearly see are are way non-proportional the you either have to roll with a sh you can't even use an assault rifle and if you do you can only use basically the MAA1 you could use used to be able to use the AN94 but then they decided to you know nerf the AN94s so now they basically made almost every assault rifle basically worthless like if you want to use an actual g a good assault rifle besides the M881 you gotta use, use select fire on the FAL or the SMR and I don't think I should be able to be forced to do that because that uses a uh, weapon slot that I shouldn't have to use also and they should definitely just nerf the sniper rifles nerf the shotgun because a sh shotgun should win anybody running should not be able to pick up their weapon and one hit kill me especially when they're running and I'm already firing at them and their screen is red and they just go like bloop pick up weapon and shoot like that doesn't happen in no sense of former fashion in any other Call of Duty game the sniper rifle that needs to be nerfed they shouldn't be able to run and then all of a sudden pick up quick draw their weapon and just fire me they don't even have a quick draw attachment so I don't even understand how they could easily just basically just shoot just pick up their weapon after running and just kill me that does shouldn't happen they should definitely make the sniper rifle more like you have to get down if you are standing up your weapon should just be swaying at everything the only way you can basically get a kill with a sniper rifle you gotta go either crouch or prone and you gotta hold your breath. Other than that, the weapon has to sway way too much for any sort of damage to actually be done. Another thing that should be taken care of, the C4. This C the C4 on Black Ops 2 is terrible. Because basically, it makes it so it's thrown like a Semtex grenade. You gotta, it can be used, it goes way too far, and it's just way too powerful in this game I s is the word I want is how I want to describe it because a C4 should not be being thrown you know half halfway across the map alright I'm exaggerating on that one but you get my drift 
it's it's acting like a grenade and it's not a grenade and that's really frustrating because c4s get thrown all the time and c4 isn't really meant to be used as a basically another form of grenade like is basically a quicker version of this semtex grenade instead of have having to wait for that loading time you don't now you can just easily throw just detonate deaths on to anybody close by so that's another thing that needs to be taken care of another thing on my wish list the skill based matchmaking whoever thought that was a great idea needs to get their head examined cough on an hard cough but still skill based matchmaking is not one of those things that people need cuz a first of all you're matching people up with their with their server area and then you're matching based on skill so that's my what some some of the stuff that's on my wish list i wish i could get into all of it but the gameplay came to an end too soon so like me on facebook follow me on twitter comment down below what you think subscribe to see more like the video if you liked it till next time this is your boy k fighter kimbao saying deuces i'm out